Yo guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all a free way to get Pokecoins in Pokemon Go. So guys, I'm going to be explaining to you what actually a Pokemon Gym in Pokemon Go is. So, a Gym in Pokemon Go is just like a Pokestop, and instead of being able just to spin it, you can spin a Gym and you can place up to 6 Pokemon on the Gym to defend the Gym for a limited time. Um, they can only be from the same team, for example, if the gym is taken by Red Team, Valor, only teammates who are currently on Team Valor can place their Pokemon on this gym, up to a maximum of 6 Pokemon, and likewise, if you are a yellow team member and you see a red gym, this allows you to battle the gym for your chance to knock them Pokemon out, to place your own Pokemon in the gym, and hopefully get your 50 coins for the day. When you are attacking a uh, different team's gym, this may take multiple times because what you are aiming to do is to knock the Pokemon out. And this can take up to three to four times to knock a single Pokemon out, depending on how long or how much motivation they have, which is also combat power. Um, and once you have knocked them down to zero CP, you will be able to take the gym. The gym will, be, will become neutral and this will allow you to place your Pokemon. When you place a Pokemon on a gym, your Pokemon will earn you one one coin every 10 minutes it is defending the gym uh, so if you are aiming to get your 50 coins for the day which is capped out at 50 so no matter how long you've had a Pokemon on that gym for you can have it on the gym for a year only earn 50 coins for that day it is knocked out and at 12 o'clock every single night this resets back to zero so for example let's say you have three Pokemon defending three different Pokemon gyms and you one gets knocked out on the Monday and it's been there for more than eight hours, you will earn your 50 coins for that day. If that second Pokemon is knocked out on that Monday as well, you will receive no coins because you have already earned your 50 coins for that day. But if that third Pokemon gets knocked out on the Tuesday and you have earned no Pokemon coins on Tuesday, you will be earning 50 coins on that Tuesday because that Pokemon would have been there for more than eight hours of the day. You will also only receive your coins once the Pokemon is knocked out of the gym. It is not like a timely basis for every 10 minutes you won't just magically earn one coin in your shop. You will have to get knocked out of the gym and when you when the Pokemon returns, it, retu it returns with the Pokemon coins you have earned. And guys, the quickest way to check what Pokemon you have currently defending gyms and how many coins you have earned for the day is to go onto the bottom right hand corner of your Pokemon screen, go to the research, uh, icon swipe over to the today tab swipe all the way down and it'll say pokey coins so today i've already earned 50 pokey coins and it says pokemon in gyms i currently have three pokemon in gyms my rhyperior my vaporeon and my salamance and guys another thing which you are able to do from the research icon like i said if you swipe to the today view swipe down to where it says pokemon in gyms it will show you what pokemon you have currently defending gyms and you can actually press on that Pokemon, it will then take you to the gym it is holding, and this allows you to feed that Pokemon berries. For example, you can feed them raspberries, nanat berries, pinat berries, and silver pinat berries. These will all give your Pokemon a limited amount of motivation, for example, combat power, and you can feed these multiple times, but do know the more times you feed them, the less effective it will become. The only other berry which you guys can use is a golden Raz berry, and when you feed your Pokemon a golden Raz, it was it will fully heal or fully motivate your Pokemon again. You can also feed other teammates Pokemon who are in the gym with you, and this will just allow you to hopefully, if you're in a very um, popular area and you want to keep your Pokemon until you receive your eight hours, if you keep feeding it, and this may uh, deter other people from attacking your gym and allow you to hold that gym for a little while longer. Another thing um, guys it allows you to do when taking gyms and holding gyms is you actually have a gym badge. If you go onto your profile in the bottom left hand corner scroll down it will show you all the badges you have and the longer you keep Pokemon on gyms the more you attack the gyms and the more you feed Pokemon on the gyms the more points you will earn and it will allow you to earn them from a bronze a silver and a gold gym badge. Uh, if you guys want to find out more about gym badges, let me know in the comments down below and I can make a video explaining in depth what a gym badge is. Also from feeding Pokemon, you can earn a, another badge on your profile, which is feeding Pokemon in gyms. And you will need a platinum badge when you get to, I think from level 46 to 47, you need so many platinum badges to do that. So this will be a quick and easy way and simple way to earn another platinum badge for your collection. 
And guys, the last thing I'm going to share with you all is how I earn my 50 Pokemon coins every single day to make sure I take full advantage of what Pokemon Go allows us to earn freely. And what I do is uh, me, my friends and my family, we meet up, we go for a car journey or for a walk around our local area. We will then take as many Pokemon gyms as possible, placing our Pokemon into the gyms. And sometimes we can take 8 gyms to 10 gyms every time we do this, which is good because this allows us to have maximum opportunity of earning our 50 coins for that day. And if we already earn our 50 coins for that day, if we have multiple Pokemon in a gym, this may allow us to keep Pokemon for multiple days. And when they get knocked out, we will be guaranteed 50 coins for at least the next three days or maybe sometimes five days um so guys this is what we do we literally just meet up we go around we take gyms we place pokemon in the gyms and this gives us the maximum opportunity to earn our 50 coins every day and hopefully for the next couple of days we can earn even more coins so guys thank you for watching i hope you guys find this video helpful if you guys do find it helpful please be sure to smash that like button if you are new around here please subscribe with that post notification bell on and if you would like to support me even more and become a member of my channel, please feel free to press the join button next to the subscribe button. This will allow you to get custom emojis and a custom badge next to your name, as well as um, have member-only posts in the community tab and member-only pictures in the community tab. But guys, with that all said, have a good day and stay shiny hunting. Peace.